we are flying deep into the heart of the constellation Orion, about 1,500 light years from home, through the great Orion Nebula. And now, the Horsehead Nebula, setting course for the Rosette Nebula, about 5,000 light years from Earth, and the cluster of very young stars at its center. Now about 6,000 light years out, listen for the sound of a rapidly spinning pulsar. That's the core of the Crab Nebula, the wreckage of an exploded supernova. We're now accelerating above the flat disk of our Milky Way galaxy. We've come now a little over two million light years from Earth. Sounds like a lot, but it's really just across the yard to our closest large neighbor galaxies, the Triangulum Galaxy and the Andromeda Galaxy. Let's greet some other close neighbors, Messier 81 and 82, the Pinwheel Galaxy and the Whirlpool Galaxy. We're turning now onto the main street of our local galactic community, the Virgo Cluster of Galaxies. Up ahead, the center of town. It's looking kind of crowded in there. So let's warp out for the cosmic countryside instead, heading for truly deep space. Every point of light we see out here is an individual galaxy, each containing tens of billions, if not hundreds of billions, of stars. We can begin to see how the universe is organized, Clusters of galaxies, connected by long filaments, surrounding huge open voids of absolute nothingness. This foamy web of visible matter is an echo of the pattern laid down 13.7 billion years ago by slight variations in the expanding bubble of the Big Bang. 